Joe, can you hear me? Professor, <laughs> are you on the plane? Finally. Well, actually, I'm, I'm just boarding, you see. Oh, this, you're, you're this an how absolute it looks like. hero. <laughs> you're an absolute hero. Thank you so much. We had all sorts of technical issues. I've been streaming for six hours for it to go wrong oh. for the last bit. <laughs> Finally. I, it's so kind. I feel like I should give you a um, proper introduction. So, guys, this is um, Professor Dr. Matthias Augustus. Um, he's the director um, um, of the Institute for Health Services Research in Dermatology and Nursing at the University Medical Center in Hamburg, Eppendorf, Germany. Right. Have I got that right? <laughs> Perfect. Thank you, Joe. Thank you for inviting me. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you for going above and beyond with our lateness to um, to still join us. Um, so, yeah, very quickly, I suppose what I wanted to get you on the show for was to tell these guys about... Um, your view on the patient's role in healthcare and how you as a dermatologist involve them in that? Well, actually, I th think uh, the situation is clear. Uh, today, uh, we are partners in uh, uh, dealing with skin diseases and uh, treating psoriasis. There's a need to have shared decisions, to share views, to participate together. And this is, uh, I think, something which is imperative now. And I know that we have the same view on this. Uh, we met several times, uh, but I, it's really time to uh, confirm this. And I did so today and yesterday in Madrid, where I'm right now, I went also before. We had a meeting in Brussels some days ago at the European Union. And uh, in the parliament, we uh, proposed the same, that, that there's need to take this as a, the role model, uh, the people-centered healthcare, including our uh, uh, the patient being in the center and we being uh, the consultants to the patient. Yeah, that's, that, and, and I, I thought it was really important. We've shared lots of um, sort of hard stories today, people with their yes. lived experience. I thought it was really important that they hear that some people think differently and that shared decision making, lived experience kind of matters. And, and mm. you know, there's people like yourselves that are promoting that. Yeah, well, actually, Joel, I think. Uh, some people may be skeptical about this but the data are there the data prove that when we have shared decisions we are more powerful we are also more efficient we save time and have a better outcome and what else can we wish absolutely 100 <laughs> percent i'm i'm, I'm going to let you go because i'm so grateful for you giving us a sound bite um so thank you so much for joining us and um yeah i hope you have a safe flight you, um, where you're heading next thank you yeah, thank yeah. you. Thank you for bye inviting bye. me and uh, bye bye. Have a good time. Bye. Thank you. Bye bye.